Now, this is how we can stop internet for WhatsApp in your Android. Let's get started. So as you can see, when you open up the settings of your phone, you're going to notice that within the apps section, you have some information and things you can tweak about like WhatsApp and other individual apps, but you don't really see the option to switch off the internet, right? Like you have some data options, but you can only disable the background data usage. So it's it might be useful, of course, but it's not the main thing. Actually, the uh, best way or the other option, which is going to work most likely is by getting an application called the NetGuard. So this type of app is also like, you know, it's going to use or has to access like your phone and everything. So if it asks for some permission, you will need to grant it. But then when you enable the NetGuard, you can see that uh, it will try and it will give you the ability to control individual applications, right? So you can see that you can turn off and on like the internet for individual apps, like, you know, WhatsApp is part of the list and everything. So you can also, also manage it in here. So it's very like useful stuff, right? And you can also manage like, you know, the access attempts and other options, uh, roaming, lockdown mode, and yeah, that's a bunch of different stuff, right? So what I've seen a lot of people use is what's called, as I said, lockdown mode, where you only allow like individual options. So that's basically how you can do that, right? So this is the way to approach it. Naturally, you're going to have to play around with it, but that's basically how it works. It's just a quick guide. So go ahead and check it out. Check out that application in the Google Play Store. And I'm pretty sure that you're going to be able to figure out the settings that suit you the best. Anyways, that's it for me. Hit the thumbs up if you liked the video. Subscribe for more tutorials and videos like this one, and I'll see you in the future.